Hey there YouTube. Today I'm doing a real life video review on this Viver exhaust fan that I got for a hundred bucks shipped off eBay. It was sold by a Vivor authorized retailer. Uh, it's on their website sometimes for almost the same price, but if you buy it off eBay, you have a great 30 day free return policy. So I'd recommend buying it from there. Amazon's usually 10 to 20 bucks more. I ordered this on eBay and it still came in about two days. All right, this is a model number SHT-30. Not the best choice of model numbers. Has a volume of 65 cubic meters per minute. The label says it's 520 watts uh, and 2800 slash 3300 RPMs. And as the arrow indicates, it blows out that end. So it sucks into the pipe and blows out the fan port. Originally, I thought this was stupid because I was like, why wouldn't I put the vent out the door and have the fan inside the house by the plug? Well, the reason is, is this is super duper loud. Um, so you really do want the fan unit outside if you can help it. Let's give you a close up shot of the fan mechanism. Um, it's got quite a lot of use in the past few weeks. Here's the switch. It's insulated with rubber, but it's a normal toggle switch. It only has one speed, so I'm not quite sure why there's two speed ratings on the label. This is what the other side of the machine looks like. The actual motor itself there. Pretty beefy. It's got nice rubber feet on the bottom so it doesn't vibrate. And the extraction hose duct uh, has rope to tighten it down. It is not elastic. And it just fits over this lip. And actually, I'm gonna see if I can fit the pipe over the other side. I never tried it. Seems like you might be able to if you wanted to. Yeah, you could totally do it this way. And you could have the unit inside. And uh, suck the air in that way and out the duct if you wanted. The duct has these D-rings on it. Um, so when you compress it, you can click the D-rings together probably to, to lock it. So if you run the cord that's used to cinch the uh, tube to the fan through those D-rings, it makes it really portable. So that's probably what that's for. You can order this with different duct lengths. Um, and I ordered this with five meters of duct see what the actual duct length was. I never actually measured it. So I fully extended this by tying one end to a door and I measured and I got 15 feet exactly as advertised. So yeah, pretty good sized tube.
yeah, that's all I got. It's an evacuator fan. It works. Uh, thanks for watching.